guys welcome back to my channel thank you so much for coming back and if this is the first time you're stopping by please do not forget to subscribe to my channel and so guys you can tell I'm so hyped I'm about to record two tutorials for you guys and they're all going to be up on YouTube I'm so excited guys you guys can tell guys we're going straight into my eyes you guys know I already have a tutorial on how I do my brows so I'm just going to go straight into my eyes today I'm using a pink shade from the Be Bella Cosmetics palette Maroon Mayhem and I'll just be using that along my crease area. Yeah, I'm going to go back in with a nude shade just to blend it and make it look seamless. At a point I felt like I lost the pink shade so I went back with my brush again and I kept on blending it like just the cardio. <laughs> So I'm going to be using my LA Girl Concealer in Fun to cut my crease today. I was supposed to go like way shades lighter but then I was quite lazy while I was recording. I didn't want to stretch and get the lighter shade and I just decided to settle with the fun. But yeah, it did cut the crease too. So. I'm going to be using my setting powder just to set the place that has the concealer and I'm just going to go in with a nude shade from the same palette and just tap it on my lid. Mix three eyeshadows from the same palette with my makeup seal from Hega and Esther to create a winged liner and then I'm going to be applying glitters in the beginning of my crease and blushes off camera. I'm going to be using the Rayon Blushes Serum Plus Primer and I'm just going to be using that all over my face. Next I'm going to be using my H&E foundation and this foundation is so good guys, you guys know already. Like I'm just going to be using it on my skin and it's like my perfect shade. Do you guys see this is like with foundation and this is without foundation. Can we actually talk about my skin though first? I'm going to be using the LA Girl in fun to highlight and I'm going to be blending that with my beauty blender. And to contour, I'm going to be going into my face palette from Zikel Cosmetics. This one is in the shade Dark Cocoa. And I'm going to be setting all the areas I highlighted with my setting powder. The setting powder I'll be using today is the Sasha Buttercup Setting Powder. And you guys know this is also bomb. Yeah. Skin work, guys. So I'm going to be dusting off this excess powder with my face powder this one is um bronze from the same palette i used to contour so i'm just going to be going ahead with the mac blush in stubborn i remember my dad bought this for me so yeah let's do it I spray my brushes before I apply my highlighter and let's glow. Do you, do you guys see this? Do you? And this is just one dip. This is just one dip. You guys. Can, can we talk about how the Tears Cosmetics isn't playing with this Tears Glow Kit? You guys are not even joking. Like I didn't even go back with my brush into the I didn't go back with my brush into the palette. This is just one brush. So guys this is the final look and yes i switched my scarf as you guys can see and i hope you guys love this look i absolutely love it and yeah thank you guys so much for watching see you guys in my next video bye guys
Tell me say what? Tell me say what? Um, unicorn elixir. Is that how it's pronounced? And guys, for this foundation, I actually do not even need to moisturize like moisturize. Can we talk about the skin work? And then let's talk about the nose too. Oh my god, guys! This highlighter. 